Hey guys, Davison here. Here are the top 10 best reactions to Dunderhead Logan Paul getting his ad suspended on YouTube for tasering a dead rat after he already got in trouble for disrespecting a dead body. Does the man never learn? Number one, Timothy DeLaghetto said, laughing my ass off, brah. Logan Paul is so dumb for this new controversy. Yes, the rat was dead already, but like, why would you fuck with the dead thing right after you got so much shit for fucking with the dead man thing? So much hate, LOL, come on. Number two from Philly D. One, this is a massive move on YouTube's part. Two, I hope they release specific policy regarding how this move works. Three, the next step should be at least temporary suspension of his ability to hit trending. Controversy and trending has been his biggest channel growth. I absolutely agree. As much as I'm a joke about this, we actually need to know how YouTube's going to apply suspensions to everyone else. A thanks for Adpocalypse 3.0, Logan Poo. On number three, Luna said, Logan Paul disrespects dead human corpse and makes joke out of it. YouTube, don't do that again. Keep your ads, but no more YouTube Red Show. Logan Paul disrespects a dead rat corpse. YouTube, due to Logan's recent actions, we've decided to spend ads from all of his channels. Finally. <laughs> number four is this awesome Twitter video from Keemstar himself. Just for, just for two seconds, okay. Logan Paul comes out with a suicide video. The whole world's upset. Everyone's mad at him. YouTube cracks down and says, listen, we're, we're removing the Google preferred ads, all right? There has to be a punishment. Logan takes a break from YouTube and he comes back with a documentary about suicide. Logan and his supporters are saying, you know, he made a mistake. He's learning, he's changing. Then he comes back to YouTube, all right? He interviews people about, you know, what they think of Logan Paul in the Suicide Forest. He has Logan Paul in Suicide Forest in the tags of that video, so he's now monetizing his own fuck up. He has this stunt where he like jumps out of the plane and the parachute doesn't open. I don't know if that's real or not. Somebody allegedly breaks into his house. I don't know if that's real or not. One of his goldfish dies and he tries to give it CPR. <laughs> He tases two rats! He tases two dumb rats! <laughs> and he tells his fans to eat two rats! <laughs> I mean, listen, I'm not laughing because it's funny. Because it's definitely not funny that he tried to tase dead rats. That is not funny. There is nothing funny about that. This is just how I deal with, with stress and trauma. <laughs> Number five from Luke Cutworth. Logan Paul? More like Logan Paul. Number six, the AB family that used to work with Logan Paul on Vine. Hey, Logan, says the FCC, we need you to distract the public about net neutrality. Logan, hold my beer. Number seven is from Lost Paws. You know, even if YouTube takes away Logan Paul's ads for tasering dead animals, encouraging eating Tide Pods and the dead body, the sad thing is that he's still super successful. And the worst part is that others will try and mimic him for his wealth while the rest of us will try and be honest. Yeah, that's absolutely the biggest tragedy, as I said before. The nice guys on YouTube suffer the consequences of the people that I, I just can't even believe make so many dumb decisions in a row for the sake of popularity. Ah, my head hurt. Number eight from Devin Sawa. Dear YouTube, get rid of Logan Paul from all of us. Number nine is from Rob Dyke. Yes, he has now used a taser on dead animals. When it comes to desecrating corpses, there is no one better than Logan Paul. And what a thing to be known for, people. He is now associated with death. I just can't even get over it. And finally, number 10 is a tie between Total Biscuit calling Logan Paul a sociopathic Barney the Dinosaur and me saying to Logan Paul, is you good, bro? Is you good, 
Because I don't think you is good anymore, bro. You gotta explain that titanium plate that's in your head next to your brain because I think something happened that pierced it because you was making some really bad decisions. You was demonetized. And you deserve it. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. My name is Davis and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and argue with me if you're a member of the Low Gang because what Logan's doing it's pretty indefensible, and that's why YouTube took action. Lala Davison video.